Oh, man. I'll tell you what. This game's soundtrack is amazing. I love it. But, uh, anyway, guys. Today, we're going to be continuing our playthrough of some more Link's Awakening for, uh, for Nintendo Switch. So, uh, hello, everybody. How are we all doing? I hope we're all having a good one. Yes, it is Link time. <laughs> it is Link time. Oh, my God, man. Anyway, uh, we're going to be continuing our playthrough. Last time we left off on, uh... I can't remember the guy's name, but we're looking for some golden leaves. I can't remember his name because we just met him. Uh, we're looking for some golden leaves, and we're also looking for a way to get into uh, into the castle. Canalette Castle, to be specific. Um, but before we do that, I want to go ahead and catch up on chat here real quick and uh, say hello to everybody. How are we all doing? Welcome. Welcome to today's stream. Happy Friday to everybody. So just as a quick little preface before we uh, before we get started... <laughs> See, everyone's commenting on my hair. Dude, I need to get a haircut, but I'm so lazy. I could have done it today, but I ended up just playing games anyway. All right. So what I was going to say is that uh, today we're going to be playing for two hours, and then uh, we're going to make as much progress we, as we can within that two-hour range. And then I got to go because my sister's coming in town today, and there's going to be a nice little family dinner that I need to go to. So um, two hours should be enough time for us to make, make some pretty good progress. Uh, throughout the day um but yeah hello everybody how's it going alec equals goth haircut please listen all right you know it's 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 just it's all natural right what's this an antenna on my head you guys see that am i an anime character now <laughs> oh man cut that mop i do i really need to man it's midnight in my part of the eu so saturday no dude why are you still awake man you should get some rest that's pretty late those two hours stay five i ugh. I know I'm, I'm I'm historically bad at setting my own parameters, but today I really need a we need to really cut it short at two hours. We we normally go a little bit longer than that, but um, you know I guess I like my sister or something. Anyway, uh, <laughs> thank you all for tuning in. So I guess without uh, without further ado, we'll go ahead and get started here on our playthrough. Uh, Mario Kart Tour Cup, please. I need more. There's like six more hours or something like that until the next one's refresh, right? Also, I ended up beating all of them, B man. I, it turns out I was actually really close to the last cup. There was like two or three more that I was missing. So I beat all of them and then got five uh, grand stars on all of them too. So <sighs> I'm, I'm on the same boat you are now, just kind of waiting <laughs> for uh, for those cups to refresh. Yes, I did five star them all. I haven't added you as a friend though yet. I need to, I, we need to compare scores. Zane, welcome to the stream. Ginger Cake, how's it going? Same Z's, I look like a dysfunctional cleaning implement. Wow. <laughs> Is that your weird roundabout way of telling me that's what I look like? Alright, I'm just gonna ignore that and uh, keep our progress going here. So what are we... Okay, we're in the town. We're in the town. Am I poor still? Do I have any money? <laughs> that sounds weird to say. Okay, I do have money. Let's, uh... It's been brought to my attention. Aha! 
This is what we missed earlier. So you can actually just buy bombs. I don't know if you can, can we use them? I don't need like a bomb bag or something. <gasps> oh my God, that would make it so much easier. Okay, this is a little different than traditional Zelda games because you can actually just buy the item and move on. Normally you would need like a key item or something like a quiver or like a bomb bag to store them in before you can use them. So it's a good thing we're, we've are we been back at the village and uh, I was since able to do that. So we can we should be able to blow up like boulders and stuff or like those little cracks in the walls. Remember those like that that thing that we were getting stuck on last time we were playing this? Just gotta figure out how to get there. I think it's I think we have to go through the forest. Ugh. I'm literally playing the shell cup just to get my score higher. Jeez, dude. Jeez. Is that the only cup that's like that qualifies for uh increasing your score? I think I'll maintain my shorter hair for a while. I really want to cut my hair shorter, but I mean it's about to get cold, so you know, like, what's the point, right? Um so, so, what are we looking for here? Gibran, welcome to the stream. How are you doing, man? What's in here? Because we also have, what the, oh, this is Ulrira. This is Ulrira. We have, um, that, like, Yoshi doll, too. I, I, can you see that in my inventory? Yeah, there it is. Yoshi doll. And I don't know what to do with that. I'm assuming you give it to somebody in the town, but I haven't I haven't seen anywhere to redeem this. There are so many moving parts it feels like to this game. Oh man, that's the okay, that's the crane game. The trendy game, excuse me. What's this? What's this? Well if you want to claim that for yourself, I'm certainly not going to stop you. Okay. Alright. Let's calm down now. What's the phone do? That only speaks to you through the phone. Yes it is. Yes it is. He's got a face. I'm kinda glad they gave him one too, because it'd be kinda be kind of, um, I don't know, I feel like I'd be left wondering the whole time if he was just a voice. Like, what does he look like, you know? That reminds me of that hand from Majora's Mask that only appears in the toilet. That sounds weird, but like, if you've played the game, you'll get it. <laughs> Alright! Um... Ba na 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 Toilet Ghost, was that its name? Ay ay ay. I'm just sitting here tumbling through the town. Yeah, Toilet Hand, that's the one. Yeah, see, you guys know what I'm talking about. That's good. I don't sound like a total crazy nut nutcase. What's in here? What's in this house? Have I even been here yet? Oh, maybe I haven't. Yep, those are my boys. I'm Papal. Pleased to meet ya! I'll be lost in the hills later, so keep a lookout for me, you hear? Uh? You give that Yoshi- oh, wow! Oh, so we just kind of stumbled upon what we needed. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> Thank you, you are indeed a generous person. Ah, I will give you this in return. Ribbon. Maybe you can trade the ribbon for something else. Uh, okay. Another thing that we have that I don't know what to do with. Interesting. It adds your totals in like three classes today. That's all I did. Didn't do anything today. <laughs> oh man, that reminds me of when I was in my uh, AQR class. So I realized over the years that AQR isn't something that uh, this class goes by in every school district. So basically it's called, it, it, the acronym means advanced quantitative reasoning. And uh, it was a math class. Mostly just kind of based on like, um, you know, using math to solve, like, logical problems and, you know, practical problems. Anyway, um, the teacher in that class, her name was Miss Days, she, uh, had, like, a love-hate relationship with me. She thought I was funny, she thought I was, like, always, like, you know, in good spirits and everything, but I just would not pay attention. <laughs> I would always have my, my phone in my bag, and, like, this is my move, right? So I'd have my, my desk and then my bag. And then my bag would be on the desk, like the opening facing me. And I just have my hands in there playing like Angry Birds or something. Because <laughs> that was back when Angry Birds was like a new thing, you know? She hated it, but she kind of allowed it because she was like, you know what? I'm, I'm going to expend too much energy trying to get him to stop. So I'm just going to let him do it. And he gets good grades anyway. So like, what's the, what's the harm, right? Floor master, wall master, now presenting the poop master. <laughs> Dude, those floor masters and wall masters, those are scary. Those are nothing to mess around with. That's the most obvious thing. I know! I really wasn't trying to 
be secretive or anything. I was just kind of, uh, you know, making it so like she looked, she could see that I was putting in an effort, but like also at the same time, not really. So, <sighs> ah, I'm getting stabbed. Let me go through this ah, forest in peace. Excuse me. All right, so now that I have, now that I have these bombs, I just need to find where those cracks in the wall were before, which should be this way, I think. We had no problem finding them before. Now it's like it's a it's a hunt. Is it this way? No. Oh, oh, I guess it is this way. Never mind. Yeah, so there's like there's like small cracks in some of the in some of the surfaces around here. That was one of them. Mm. There's more Olrira over there. And there's also like a monkey. I think I think he wants a banana or something. And we also have a ribbon. I don't know. I don't know. There's there's a couple of things that I'm still kind of confused about on what we're doing. Like what the objective is, but I'm sure over time we'll just come across what the answer will be. Because that seems to be the way it's been working out thus far. I'm patiently waiting for Alex to fall down a hole. Not gonna happen! Not gonna happen. How can Keaton K. Rule survive at 250? Because he's thick. Because he's thick. He still show up in my nightmares scene. Oh my god. Let me through. Look at that. Wow. That was the answer all along. I just needed to go spend some money. Which usually isn't the answer, but I guess in this case it is. How do we get this? Heart piece, pothole field? I don't know. I don't know. Um, oh look, a house. Wait, is this the frog guy? Is this the frog prince? Very, I know, I know. It is the frog guy, okay. So. Um. I think, hold on. Let's go talk to Ulrira and see. And see what he has to say. Richard, yeah, isn't that the name of the dude that we're looking for? Or no, am I wrong? Wait, was that Richard? I'm so... <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. It's hard, like, playing a week later and, like, trying to remember all the stuff that we were left off on. Hi. Yeah, okay. Better to wait at home. Okay, cool. He wants us to go to the castle, and uh, we're gonna make our way to do that. So, okay, so let's head to the castle. Um, there's a really big pothole in front of my schoolyard. In front of your school? Why has that not been filled yet? That sounds like a hazard. Excuse me. All right, let's talk to Oreo. Let's see if he has any useful advice here. Uh, you haven't found the five golden leaves? Try bombing suspicious places. Okay. I guess that's somewhat useful, now that I know that the... Some of the golden leaves will be in, like, bomb spots, but... But where? Where are those spots? If I was a bomb spot, where I'd be hiding? Where I would be hiding? Where- where I'd be? Hmm... Animal village and... What was that? Martha's Bay? Whoa. <laughs> that was not me. <laughs> so one of the enemies blew that up. Um, Bring it. Bring it. Whoops. Okay, that's deep water. Got it. Good to know. A weird object. There must be some way to tackle this obstacle. There must be. It's not a bomb, is it? It is not. Um, what are these things? They look like tents. <gasps> what? Okay, I'm gonna assume that I can't do anything about that right now. Let's go back upstairs. I didn't fall down a hole, I went down the staircase into the hole. S small difference, small difference. <gasps> Um, excuse me, maybe in here? 
I don't know. Tackle. Oh, Dog Weasel, have you played this game? Have you played this game before? This is my first time ever playing Link's Awakening. The original and this version, so... All this is new to me. Uh... Enemies everywhere! Oh my god, whatevs. Whatevs! Give me your shell! <laughs> There's nothing in here! There must be something in here, right? <gasps> Wait, there it is. There it is. I played the original on the old brick on release. Nice. Yeah, I don't know why I never played the original. I guess... I guess it just never called out to me, but... Um, this is also my first 2D Zelda game, ever. I've never played a 2D version. Uh... Uh... Hmm. I guess we can go this way, right? Whoop! Have you tried looking in the place that they are? I should. I really should do that, you know? I'm just bad at the game! That's what it is! There we go. And this... on the wrong way. Play a link to the past, you'll get it for free anyway. Get it for free. Oh wait, no, it's on the it's on the SNES classics, right? Or the NES. I don't know. What system was that for? <laughs> I I genuinely have never played a 2D Zelda game, so I have no clue. And this is a rock. Link, that is the fifth time you've brought a rock to show and tell this week. Okay. Uh Ukuku Prairie. Oh wow, I thought he was gonna die in one hit. Die, you fiend! Thank you. Round here, secrets are nigh. Wow. I did that entire puzzle room just to just to be told that. Um Hmm. Not bombs, right? Probably not. Yeah, I didn't think so. Uh This is a toughie. This is a toughie. Um I guess we can head back this way and hope to everything good in the world that we don't get hit by anything. Okay, we're good. <sighs> um Well I wonder. Oops! I can't swim yet! <laughs> this is so scary! I placed a bomb on accident. Can you imagine, like, playing this game on hero mode? The amount of courage you must have. Maybe it's the way you're dressed? I <laughs> mean... Ugh. I don't know. Maybe it's the fact that I'm, like, the main character or something, that all these things are happening to me. I don't know. Just a guess. Um... So, there's, like, this monkey, right? Hungry. So, Kiki is hungry. I'm assuming we need, like, a banana. Right? Because there's, there's like, that shop that has bananas. We can't open this yet, either. Um... Um... Okay. Let's start from the very beginning of this- of this area here. Eee! Ooh, oh my god! Really? Really? That sucked me in! Are you kidding? Alright, we haven't gone in here yet, so I guess this is worth investigating. Ooh. What the heck is... What do you do here? Ooh, it's all jiggly. 
<laughs> what the heck? Uh... Must be some way to tackle this obstacle. Um... Hmm... I'll come back for that later. Uh... Oh my god, man. I need... I need... A tailor! Okay. So... We have a ribbon. Uh... Maybe... I don't know, I'm running out of ideas! Let's go head back into town, I guess. This puzzles, I know. Puzzles on puzzles. Um... Who have we not talked to in a while? Like these kids? Giant egg on top of Mount Tama Ranch? Windfish is sleeping inside of it. I don't know either. Um, this has just all the books in it, right? Yeah, yeah, it does. Uh, you gonna play Dragon Quest XI? I do not have any plans to play Dragon Quest XI at the moment. I wanna, I wanna play it and see, uh, I wanna play the demo and see if I enjoy the gameplay first before I do anything. Does everyone just want, like, these random items that I'm getting across town? My chick baby Chow Chow has been pining for a new accessory. I mean, we have one. I would direct them to the doghouse on my premises. Okay, we're going to the doghouse. Wow. So, I'm guessing whatever item we get here, we'll have someone else in town that we're gonna have to give it to. Makeup, jewels, dresses, I want it all. That's what, that's what chain chomps sound like in my head. Oh, that ribbon. I need it. Will you trade it for my dog food? Oh my god, that's adorable. Isn't that... Th th wait, um... There's, uh... There's that alligator on the beach that collects, like, he. I think he called it, like, weird canned foods or something? Maybe that's who we give this to. In the meantime, though, I'm gonna replenish my bombs, because I am low. And I feel like we're gonna need them here in a little bit. Feed the monkey dog food! <laughs> That's what'll get the windfish up and running. Some dog food. Alright. Ten bombs, I think we're good. Chain Chomp is gonna get what it wants. Shiz. Let's get some shiz. Let's get some shiz. Alright, to the beach! To the beach! Away! Man. I really wish that Link ran a little bit at a little bit of a faster pace than just this slow waddle that he does. That would help immensely. Try and steal from the shop. I know that there's some repercussions for that and I'm not gonna fall for it. Don't steal from the shop while you're literally ready for the rest of the game. See, Morks! See? I'm not falling for your bamboozlery. Also, Happy Fox, welcome to the stream, dude. How you doing? Choose is iconic. True. I wonder what Kelly's up to these days. <laughs> She's still kind of like riding on the coattails of that success. Where is... Where is this alligator? I think it's here. Like, we have to go all the way down and then to the right. Woo! Yeah, we, we're this way. We're good. I figured it out. Yeet. All right, let's see. I think his name is Sunny. I might be wrong. Or sail. Sail, that's what it is. Yep, we, we were right here. For heaven's sake, man, give that to me! And then he's gonna give us banana since he runs this banana shop, and then we'll give that to the monkey! And then the monkey will give us whatever the monkey will give us. I am actually, I haven't, con I haven't concluded what that's gonna be. Ew, he ate the can and everything! Taking a leisurely stroll to save the island. Are they in peril, though? Everyone seems to be living perfectly fine. You know what I was thinking about before this stream started? Is... I know that Link kind of washed up on this island just out of, like, total sheer luck. He was sailing, and then, like, that storm hit, 
and then he wakes up on the beach, and then uh, Marin finds him. Where was he going? Like, what was his mission before that? Gave him dog food and got bananas in return. Heck yeah, dude. All right. The money is just going to give a battering ram so you can bust down the door, please. Please, monkey, give me the battering ram so I can bust down the the, the doorway of, um, of Canalet? Canalet Castle. Link is a wash-up hero, truly and literally and figuratively. All of the above. All right, now we waddle our way to the monkey. And that'll take however long it does. He's a gator, he's got teeth, but wouldn't that, like, hurt? Aluminum against its gums? I guess it's kind of hard to imagine, because hu human, human mouths are a little different than alligator mouths. <laughs> Did you guys know that? Fun fact. Alligators are different than people. Okay, okay, okay. Luna, welcome to the stream, dude. How's your how's your rusty level going? Still can't think of ideas for a creative rusty level. Oh my gosh. Well, you guys have three more days. Three more days to do so. Piranha Plant, welcome to the stream. All right, monkey. I'm here to give you some bananas. I better get something real cool in return. I had to walk around all across the village just to get to this banana point. That was like a... You guys ever seen that TED talk of like trading up? The guy that started with a paperclip and ended up with like a house or something? All right, what do we got? What are we getting? Give to Kiki? I mean, yes. Speaking of monkeys, I'm excited for Super Monkey Ball coming to the Switch soon. What the heck is go- These are some intelligent monkeys! Look at them! They're building like a bridge or something! <laughs> wow! Link is running a crooked op- He's running a crooked operation. He pays his employees in bananas. I don't find that uh, morally right. I don't find it morally just. You found a stick monkey left behind. You take it. Oh boy. That'll be interesting to find the use for that stick. All right, we can't swim through those because it's too deep. Dralikello Kermit, welcome to the stream, dude. How are you? These monkeys are Vikman. <laughs> True. True. All right, Ulrira, point me in the right direction here. Bet the boss trooper in the castle still has one. Uh oh. Boss trooper in the castle. You have the boots. I have my shoes. Uh, I don't know what you mean by boots, though. Spider Man is back, by the way. I saw that this morning. I think it's cool. I wasn't like heartbroken or anything by the news that was out before, though. But cool for people that are fans of Marvel and stuff. Aya! Aya! All right, we climb. We climb. Mackenzie, welcome to the stream, man. What the? What the? Nice try! Haha, <laughs> you thought, ow. Uh. Get outplayed. Mentally and physically. Did you guys see that? There was not a chance that that knight had any sort of. any sort of advantage over me. What? How many times is he gonna hit my shield before he gets knocked back? Frog house. <laughs> yeah, we already stopped by the frog house. Good old Richard, the frog king. Prince. Woo! Yeah, that would be awesome, Luna, if I had like running boots or something. <laughs> Cause Link kind of waddles. A little slowly for now. Oh my god. Whatever. You just stay in the corner. Like some weird game of whack-a-mole. Golden Leaf! Golden Leaf! 
Super Monkey Ball still a thing? I thought that series died years ago. Um, I don't think it's had like a new game anytime recently, but Super Monkey Ball, I think Banana Blitz. I can't remember the subtitle for it, but there's a Super Monkey Ball remaster coming to Switch relatively soon, and I'm excited for that. Because like, I liked playing it in the arcade years ago, and um, I thought it was really fun and it'd be really cool to actually buy it, buy one of the games. I believe you need it for the story. I like the boots. Oh, okay. We'll come across. We'll come across them sooner or later. Woo! What the heck is this thing? Ow! I'm hoping we're going the right way here. Golden Leaf! Look at that! Look at that! <laughs> Petition for a new Knights game? Oh man, that's a really easy way to get on Mika's good side. <laughs> stand arm, arm in arm as you stand up for your right for a new Knights game. That'd be kind of cool though. I think a modernized version of Knights would look really pretty. Okay. <clears throat> uh... He wanted you to know I'm a fellow Black Eagle. Mackenzie, nice! You chose the right house! You chose the right house! I know I asked you that on Discord, but thank you for coming by and letting me know here. What made you choose uh, Black Eagles, just out of curiosity? Um, Hold on, Mr. Knight, let me pick up this item. Oh yeah, sure thing, Link. Yeah, don't worry. <laughs> exactly, right? Everything stops around him while Link picks up an item. Very important. Yeah, I know. Totaka song is in there, Gibran. I've seen it. I've seen it. I like give me monies, dude. I need monies too. I need monies after all the awesome games that are coming out in the next couple months. What the? That is not what I was expecting behind that door. Woo That's three. That makes three out of seven. I think we're looking for seven. Alright, uh, close enough. Give me another one. Give me another one! Oh. Oh well. Yeah, I was kind of expecting like another passageway that way, but oh well. I'm assuming that's like the final boss over here or whatever. Or like the mini boss for the castle. He looks big and important and he's also golden. So, golden leaf, possibly? Oh yeah, I love it. Tataka song. Tataka song is so good. The first experience I had with that song was back in Luigi's Mansion. The original one on the GameCube. And then I was like, do other people, like, know that the music changes if you wait long enough in the menu? And then I, I did some research and I was like, oh, this is like an Easter egg, like an ongoing Easter egg. And that was like the first time I had any sort of inclination as to what Totaka song even was. It was cool. What the heck is this? What? What? There's like a... It looks like a shop. I don't know. Might not be considered traditional to you. Um... It depends. Like, what, what, what makes you think it wouldn't be? Hi, by the way, did you see the new news on the Pokemon channel? Yes, I did. Yes, I did, DJ Riolu. Are you excited for the new season of the anime? And there's also like a bunch of Krabby or something. That are showing up on the uh, on the Pokemon website. Whatever that's supposed to mean. Rabby getting a Galar form, maybe. I wouldn't be surprised because a lot of the Galarian forms are based off of Kanto Pokemon for whatever reason. Ew! Oh my God, they're crawling! Ew, that's so gross. Ew. Okay. That was actually kind of nasty. <laughs> I do not like bugs. Swing! Swing at me, I dare you! Oh my god, this pig! Real roadhog energy. Okay, what's this? <gasps> A house? Okay, let's go inside. You, I hate spiders. Same! Same! And they're doing a Bear Watch S thing for 24. I saw that! I saw that too! 
a couple of different bits of uh, information coming out from Pokemon today. I am the spirit of the mansion. I have been waiting for someone, one who can overcome the darkness. Find the secret shells, then ascend the platform. You will receive the ultimate sword. Come back with lots of shells. I have a couple of those. Must not have enough. Okay. I'm really excited for the live stream. I want to tune in as well. Just to see, like, what even's gonna happen, you know? They've been doing a really good job of, like, hyping up Pokemon Sword and Shield. I'm assuming it's gonna be Sword and Shield related. Secret Seashell! Look at that! I don't know what this is. It's like a steamy pile of land. Nothing. Well, uh, we kind of traversed through the castle here. And I didn't find anything. Ah, he's giving chase! Oh man, Link officially goes into people's houses without anyone's permission confirmed. I mean, when has he ever asked for permission, you know, to go and, uh, <laughs> to go into people's houses? All right, um... Let's see. So... Just make one more pass through here. There's really nothing over here, huh? Whoops! What was in here again? Go through one more time. I wonder if we can beat Zelda 1 without picking up the sword. <laughs> you sound like one of the recommended YouTube videos I get in my feed all the time. Can you beat Mario Odyssey without jumping? Can you beat Pokemon Emerald with just a Caterpie? Alright, there's nothing there. Nothing there. Well, basically the floor is a snake block and you have to keep up with. That's fine. That's traditional for me. I think that is A-OK, -okay, Happy Fox. Um... Hmm... Okay. You can actually beat Super Mario Odyssey without jumping. I haven't actually watched any of those videos, so I have no clue <laughs> if, like, any of those statements are true or, like, what the results are. The Pokemon one, though, I can totally get. Like, if you, if you stack that Caterpie enough and if you... Die. And if you, um... Give it the right- Hey! 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 I didn't mean it! It was a- it was a- it was a joke! What the- Oh my god! Th that thing had a golden feather? How was I supposed to know that? I'm just grasping at straws here, like throwing stuff. Uh, well, you know, I guess it worked out, so. Look at the little way- Look at the way that Link waddles when he's carrying something over her head that's so- that's so cute. The whole game is so nice. How kills birds confirmed. The game made me! I was gonna have to regardless. Nintendo kills birds. Link kills birds. Ultimate sword by finding shells. Why do I feel like it's gonna have some sort of like nautical feel to it, you know? I don't know. <sighs> Let's see. All right, well, there's got to be a way to fight this Golden Knight thing in here, right? Because he, he said, or Rira said, that this knight is going to have- Whoa! I'm just going to run past these dudes. If I can! If I can! Excuse me. Excuse me. Uh, or Rira said that um, this knight has something, has something to do with it. But like, how do you get there is the thing. It looks like a cute little playset that I want desperately. I would immediately buy a playset that's themed around Link's Awakening, this one. I would use all my monies 
Is it something to do with the pots? Wow. <laughs> wow. Jesus. He does so much damage. <laughs> Woo. Get juked, buddy. No! Ah! I was I was too low health to be able to, to to be able to try that, but we have a fairy, so it's okay. Do you have a fairy? I don't think so. Ow. He's still hitting me. Oh my god. This fairy just carried me. <laughs> Alright. The final one! Wow, that was easy. Now go see Richard about that reward. Alright, we gotta waddle our way over there too. Well, that was so obvious, it wasn't obvious, right? I assumed it was like, uh, I don't know, like you needed an item or something to open that, but you literally just throw a pot at it. <laughs> Indy, welcome to the stream. The read, I know, dude. I know, that that knight was getting those frame one reads. He's insane, he was popping off. <laughs> How's it going, Indy? We're playing some more uh, Link's Awakening. We're continuing where we left off from last time. And uh, you're still pretty early on in the stream here, so you really haven't missed all that much. Ma T Taren, what are you doing here? I see you have a nice stick. Can I borrow it for a second? You sure can. Here you go. I hope he's not gonna... Oh. What have you done? What have you... Okay, he has to live with those consequences. That is, uh... <laughs> that is something that he is gonna have to deal with. But on the plus side, we have a honeycomb. This is like another another trade route thing that we have to figure out. Did he just walk forward to death smash? <laughs> Steal something from the shop? No! No! You guys are not going to fool me that easily. This game is one big trading side quest. I see Link has watched this TED talk that this is from. Has anyone seen that? Does anyone even know what I'm talking about? Or do I just sound like a crazy person? All right, Richard's over there. Isn't there like a, an easier way to get there? Never mind. This is this is where he is. <gasps> Whoops, wrong house. Anyway, we have the leaves. Ah, très bien. I see you have recovered all of the leaves. Now, move this statue, and you will find your reward. Move the statue. Ooh, do I get to turn into a frog? To swim in water? I hope so. Frog Link, Frog Link. If we can get Frog Cloud, we can get Frog Lead. Frog Link. I want to nay nay on my opponents in this game. No! We have to move further into the dungeon. Secret Seashell, though. Those are going to be useful later. If I can find all of them. Is there, like, a finite amount of seashells, or do they just randomly spawn? Link shall not be branded a thief! True. I'm the hero of time. I got other things to do than steal from local businesses. You're supposed to support local businesses, not steal from them. God, you guys are savages! <laughs> uh... Oh, jeez. Like a little maze. Never. I will never steal. No! <laughs> okay. Uh, I don't know if this is the right way or not. No? Okay. This way, this way. You guys are keeping count! That's so toxic! Gotta be very careful. Before we re reveal a hole. Nope, not this way. What the heck? Then, can I... No! Okay, I'll just jump across. Give me... The heart container. How are you supposed to get there? Lamau. 
<laughs> easy. Easy peasy. Another another heart piece. I haven't been keeping count as to how many we have of those yet, so I don't know if we're close to another heart container or not. Heart container! Mika, I'm getting it right this time. I'm using the scientific, the official names for both of them. Anyway. In soil sleeps secrets beneath your souls. That was cryptic, but you know what? Um, I am not surprised. Okay. Ugh. Big brain words. True. This is big brain time. Um... So, where are we supposed to go? Wow! If not that way... I know, we're supposed to go up top left, aren't we? Okay. Hiya! Let me through, let me through! No! I'm trying to hack and slash my way through this too fast. I gotta, sl I gotta slow my roll, I gotta calm down a little bit. So much grass to cut. Look at this. There's money hiding everywhere. Am I supposed to be going this way? Did I miss it? Um. Did I did I miss something? I feel like I'm supposed to be getting like a like a like a power up or, or something. Unless I completely I don't think I did though. Uh What is here? This is another one. I feel like there's gonna be another one of those instances where the answer is like really obvious, but like too obvious, so I'm not catching on to it immediately. Pink is so cute! Cause like, I feel like we get a power up here, and then we can use it on this part of the map that's right above us. And soil sleeps secrets beneath your souls. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. We're supposed to use shovel, maybe? Aha! I am so big brain. Oh my god. Slime key. You can now open the gate in Ukuku Prairie. Cool. All right, now we go this way. Okay, okay. Very nice, very nice. Now we just got to... Right here. Interesting. Very clever. All right, another dungeon. Here we go. I'm assuming this is where we get like the frog thing. Ooh, woo, woo, Prairie. <laughs> Those things literally make a fart noise whenever they attack you. Now the next question is, how do we get there? Are you supposed to just? Can we push this? No. Nope. Um. There's like little. There's like little stones over there that you can hop from. Maybe we have to go around. Link is cute. What do you mean, Lunav? Just look at him. So adorable. Um. And we have to really legit go all the way around. Look at this. Ulrira, save us. I need your tips. It's this way. It's this way. Right here. Right here. Boom. We are so big brain. Oh my god. We're so smart. All right. Into the dungeon we go, and I guess we can call this the slime dungeon? Maybe? <laughs> I don't know. Um, 
Let's see. Okay, so this is... Here's what it is. So it's the Key Cavern. I wanted to get to the name real quick. Bombs! Oh wait, I'm supposed to use that on the door. We know what to do with that door, true. True. Da -da 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 -da. Boink. Has a uh, broken pot icon. I, I, I first for the first time I saw that I thought it was like a potion or something, you know? Oh my! Oh my! Lots of doors here. Ooh! You need another big brain container to support that big brain of yours. See, Jabron gets it. Jabron understands. All right, moving up. I'm going to assume that killing the enemies in each of these rooms will give me something, hopefully. In this case, it did not. Very cool. We love that. Ooh. Nothing? Nothing. All right, we're going down. Isn't there another slime around here? Yeah. All right, um... There's actually nowhere to go here. We don't have keys. We don't have keys! We need keys! Dark Angel, welcome to the stream. See, this game, it, the, the enemies in it, they're manufactured to hit you. Works. It's all part of the plan. All of it is calculated. Every, every possible degree. Get away from me. Woo! Well, that worked out, I guess. What is this? What do you do with this? I don't even know. For as much of the stuff as we figured out so far, I have no clue what to do with those weird things. Those weird gelatinous tent looking things. Ow. But if I go through here, maybe it's this way? Well, then get some keys, Alec. Evie! Hello, Evie. <laughs> I saw your comment, by the way, on the uh, stream from yesterday. Mm. Something. Something, something, something. Uh. Ooh. This is a toughie. This is a toughie. What are we supposed to do here? I'm not sure. Um. Hmm. What do you guys think? Go out and throw it at one of these. Maybe? No. More bombs though. Um. Hmm. Okay, think. Stop it! What was... We need to examine our surroundings. This game, sometimes you'll encounter a problem that seems like it's unsolvable. But as a matter of fact, it is. Where to God. Need a small key for any of these. For any of these. Um. Hmm. Sheesh. Uh. I'm stumped a little. Maybe. I need more equip slots. I don't want to put away my feather because it lets me jump. But oh well. Maybe we need like a bomb here or something? No. 
There must be a reason why it's giving us bombs, right? There must be. SBA, welcome to the stream. That's why you can't run through the black rocks. I must, yeah, I, I kind of thought that was the case. But the question is, like, what do we do in this first part of the dungeon here? You th try throwing a bomb at the windy thing. Oh, well, it kind of pushes you away, though. Take a pot and throw it at the windy thing. Can you take the pot over here? No. Um... I don't know. I don't know if the... If we, we need to go into this room first. I think whatever we need to do is gonna be on the, uh... Like, on the, on the upward part of the dungeon, like this way. Well, it was an idea. Yeah, that was a good idea. I thought you were onto something there, but unfortunately, doesn't seem like that's the case. Um, hmm. Hmm. All right. Well, I guess we go again. Did he drop anything? Did we actually kill this thing? Ow! Christ! What is the play- oh. What is the play against those things? I'm half a heart now because of that. All right, what do we got? Small key! Small key! Wow! That's all it was, is that I didn't defeat technically all of the enemies in that first room. I don't know what to say to that. Uh, you're feeling what I'm feeling, I'm assuming, Mika. Golly. Wow. I guess I was just overthinking it. <laughs> we all were, I suppose. Whoop! Ooh, hearts. We'll kill the things, get the keys. That seems to be the objective. Thank goodness that we're playing on a lower difficulty because I'm getting hearts and we don't have to walk all around the place. If we die. Uh, well, I guess the next question is which door do we open? I'll play the original, but that was uh, years ago that I don't find it worth it to play it again. But then again, I said the same about Captain Toad and look who caved. Captain Toad's adorable though. We'll go to the right. 3 a.m. Welcome to the stream. How are you doing? Uh... I picked wrong. I did the wrong thing. Oh, never mind. We can just go this way. What? What is that creepy thing, though? That's actually kind of scary. Why is it like that? Hold on. Wait a minute. I think I just figured out how to kill this thing. Maybe it takes a bomb? No. Bomb from here? Almost. Bomb from here. I'm so big brain! Aha! All that for a nut. <laughs> hey, Alex, this Sunday I'm going to Hawaii. I'm so excited. Nice, dude. Congrats. That's going to be awesome. Welcome to the stream, Vody. Thank you for sharing that with us. I have never left the country, so I have no idea what that's going to be like, but I'm excited for you. All right. Defeat all the enemies. Get the keys. What we got to do? There it is. Boom. Boom! Cool. He acquired. Game's adorable, though. Look at its art! I know! It's so cute! It's kind of similar to Captain Toad in that way, right? Well, it is It is part of the United States, but it's, it's, part of, it's off of the mainland, you know? Uh... Oh, gee, I don't know. There's so many keys to... Whoa. Ew! Uh-huh. These things are kind of gross, though. Uh-huh. How did that not... 
I need more bombs. Oh my god, I'm messing. I'm messing up. Get destroyed. He missed! Thank you. Oh, whatever, dude. Whatever! My bomb's too good for you? I don't, I don't have any more. <laughs> this sucks. I need more. I need more. The creepy thing to be like, TP. <laughs> He's like, I'm out. What the heck? It throws like ninja stars or something. How did I catch that by surprise, though? I was able to hit it once. I don't think I can actually land a hit if I don't. Ah! Die! Whatever. I'm out. See ya. <laughs> I wish I had this wall in real life. Someone's talking nonsense, and you're like, all right, I'm out. And you, like, go behind a wall. Oh, there's a chest up there. There's a chest up there. This is gonna be a dungeon full of just locked doors and keyholes and all that other stuff. Oh man, I need the feather. Actually, do that. I don't think we'll need the shovel for a little bit anyway, so. Should be fine on that front. Oh, we need a beak. We need a beak. Make them hit each other, maybe? I don't know, I'll come back to it here in a little bit. Wow, 50 rupees, cool. Uh, although now that I know that I can buy weapons and stuff from the shopkeeper, that I'm not, I'm not too, I'm not too let down from finding rupees like I would be in other Zelda games. Weird things be like, I am a head out. Every time I get near them, that's what they do. Okay. So... Can this thing move? Thank you. I guess we just walk down this way. Magic acorn. Ah, there's so many! Kill the jello. Alright, there must be a way to kill these things. I think you might be onto something, Nika. Ah! Okay, no, they can't hit each other. Never mind. I'm out. See ya. See ya. Put a bomb where they TP. Oh, maybe. I'm so low health though. Ooh, that is big brainius. Big brainium in my cranium. I don't know. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. Yeah. Oh wait, they TP to their original spots up here. Ha 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 ha! That was actually really smart. Very nice, Sandy. <laughs> and we got a key out of that. Heck yes. The more keys, the better, because there's just, like, locked stuff everywhere. Um. Give me hearts! I need hearts! Oh, I missed. <laughs> hmm. These are Stalfos, right? Skeletons? They don't look like they normally do, or what I'm used to, but I think those are Stalfos. Oh my god, these things. No! I tried to block it, but whatevs. Whatevs! I'm so low HP! Hearts! 
minutes. All right, what's in here? Give me a key. Give me a key. Or a compass. That works too. <laughs> now you can see where chests and nightmare are hidden. This compass has a new feature. A tone will tell you if a key is nearby. Oh, cool. I'm going to be listening for that. It's in that chest, isn't it? Up there? I, I bet it totally is. All right, we'll use the key here. We'll open that box thing. What would you even call that? I don't know. And we move up. Another key. All right, I'm out of keys. Oh, I'm out of keys. Okay. I need to go fight those things, I guess. Go through this door. Now, I only have six bombs right now. We have to make these count. Um, on. Oh, thank God the other one ate it. I hate this. I hate this. I need more bombs. You guys are dumb. You guys are dumb. I'm not going to have enough to kill them. So, do I need to, like, go buy more bombs now? Can the shopkeeper, like... Amazon Prime them to me at this dungeon so I don't have to leave. Oh, bomb. Yay. Yay. Okay, um... Oh, this thing. Seems like I'm stuck on this end of the dungeon. I need uh, at least six or more bombs would be great. Maybe I could just farm these. I don't know. Yeah, they're not dropping anything anymore. Fantastic. Hmm. Piece of power. Whee! Yikes. Has one hit that thing. I don't want to use a bomb on it. It's a waste. The waste. Not even worth my time. On the plus side, I'm almost back to full health though. Ten. Oh, that would be so great. Ow. I don't even... okay. <laughs> Ugh. Alright, now we'll go fight those weird things that look like they belong in a Studio Ghibli movie. Away! I keep thinking I could jump over that, but I cannot. Alright, so we have 14 bombs. 14 bombs should be more than enough. I hope you step on a Lego, for all I care. It's like, you have to put it on in front of it right as it's about to move. Or else it won't eat it. Oh my god. Turn around, turn around, turn around! Ah! Oh, it still ate it, cool! Whoops, I did not mean to do that. One more. One more bomb. Come on! Alright, I have four. I have four! There we go. Jeez. <laughs> that was so... Difficult, for some reason. Okay. Um, can I open this chest from behind? Nope. Nope. Not at all. Not even close. Like, none of that is mine. Uh, ha! Boots! You got the Pegasus boots. If you hold L, you can dash. Try going for a long jump. Oh, that's what those are for! Cool! If I do this, 
Maybe? <gasps> That's what opens them! That's what opens them! You've interrupted my FE session? You're interrupting my FE session! How are you doing, Magic? <laughs> Welcome to the stream. How's your day going? I hope it's going well. Ow. We're just, uh, you know, figuring things out here in Link's Awakening. For the Nintendo Switch! I need another key. Or a couple more keys. Hiya! Oh, this is gonna help so much with all these other puzzles that I was wondering about. You got a small key, it can open a locked door. Wahoo! I'm out! Alright, let's go back. I don't have to do all that legwork again. Uh, this way. Get off me! They're, they're, the haunted jello, it's everywhere. I'm chilling with my tea and starting my chaotic post time skip golden deer children. Nice. Nice. Do you have tea like every day or something? I feel like every time I see you in a stream, you're talking about how much uh, you're enjoying your tea. Um, there's one key left before we can go down that staircase. Did you see that maneuver? That was insane. Ah, it's up there. You have to go for the long jump, they said. But how do you get there? I got a question. Uh, why you quit Twitch? You got way more views at Twitch. No, I didn't. <laughs> I did not. I, I, I streamed on Twitch like maybe a handful of times. And, um, I don't know, just like, our audience is here. I don't know if we'll ever move there in the future, even considering how weird and, like, inconsistent their their moderation is on that platform. But I don't know. At the very least on YouTube, I like, I do something and I can tell you without a doubt that if, if it's going to go against guidelines or not. Whereas on Twitch, it seems like pretty much nobody has any sort of clue. Oh, wow. Okay, so there's these things on the left. These things on the left. Excuse me! Whatever. I'm just gonna let him do his thing. Whee! Is that the last key? I never played a Zelda game? Whoa! People like that exist? That's crazy! <laughs> That's awesome. Well, I'm sort of in the same boat as you as well. I've never played a 2D Zelda game. And here we are. Oh my god, rupees? Really? I mean, it's 300, so I guess that's pretty cool, but... I'm looking for a key! I'm looking for a key! Not rupees. I've never played a Zelda game either. Wow. Wow. You, you never played a Zelda game either? You guys are nuts! They're so good. Do Twilight Princess first. If you're ever gonna play a Zelda game, play Twilight Princess first. I think that one's my favorite of all time. One of them. One of them. But if you have a Switch, then just do uh, Breath of the Wild. That would make the most sense, right? Um. Hmm. Okay, I think we're missing something here. Uh, never be mad at money, I guess. Can dash through the wind. We already did. We collected the chest that was over here. Like this one. So, I don't think there's anything to do there. Mm. Oh my god. Get away from me. You weirdos. This way? No. Mm. You can't escape my blade. Hmm. We 
We're missing we're missing one key. Get us through that little passage. Oh, that kills those things too. Nice. Nice. Up the stairs. So keys you'd be lord crazy. If you're starting out, my personal recommendation is Wind oh, Wind Waker's a good one too. Then I would do Arcadian of Time or Majora's Mask. Those are awesome as well. Those are awesome as well. I guess in the in the grand scheme of things, Twilight Princess might be a little bit harder to get your hands on than uh, some of those other ones that you listed. So you might be a little bit more in the right on that one. As far as uh, accessibility goes. I love, love, love Twilight Princess. It's so good. It's so good, Indy. I'm so glad you think the same way too. That is quite possibly my favorite Zelda game. I still haven't really been able to come to a conclusive uh, decision about whether or not I think Breath of the Wild is my favorite Zelda game of all time. So I don't know. I don't know yet. I'll have to think about that one for for a couple for for a while before I come to a like a conclusive decision with that. How do we get over there? Then we just reset it? Wow. It's hard to aim this dash attack. Um, we already did this room. Cleared that out. But this didn't give us anything. I don't know. That was your first Zelda game? That's crazy. I don't know. I don't know what to do here. I might be lost again. Just when we thought we were making progress. Uh, saying something, but you can't make it out. We need to get up there on the top right somehow. But I'm not sure how. Uh, I don't know. Do you guys have any ideas? I'm lost. I'm lost. Was the mini game on Nintendo Land? Hey, ch you know what? That mini game is actually kind of fun. I, I hope that one day Nintendo said, decides to like either remaster or just remake Nintendo Land in some way for the Switch. I think that would be awesome. Such an underrated game, in my opinion. Um... Nothing. There's probably like, I don't know, like a, like one of those switches or something that changes those so I can open that chest. Almost back at square one again. Oh man, uh... Arrows on the ground, like where it points? Um... Push me! Okay, there's nothing this way either. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. Um. Maybe... Let's go through every room. Every room. Whole counter. Hey, you counted that as a whole? Wow. Every room. So maybe, maybe if we go through like the Dodongo snakes again, like where these are? Maybe there's something here? No. No, we were already up that way anyway. Uh... No. Golly. Um. 
Google's the answer. <laughs> I could do that, but I kind of want to figure it out myself, you know? Oh my god, just leave me be! I think we can just charge at him, right? Yeet. Huh. Go all the way back to the top here, too. Okay, so this drops nothing. God! This game... I, I feel like I get lost so much. We can't talk to this owl statue if we don't have a, the beak. Oh, God. That was a horrible chain reaction. <laughs> They all just died instantly. Uh... Nothing. Literally nothing. There's nothing here. Beakless statue. Compass says there's stuff up here. Which we can't really get to. There, there's like a little blow-up spot over there. Oh! Wow! Wow, dude! <sighs> Sometimes, like, the answers that you find to these puzzles, you're, you, you're just like, why? Why is it like this? How am I supposed to, like... <sighs> Maybe it's my fault. I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, I think we figured out that part of the puzzle. So, like, how do we get up there again? I think it's this way, actually. Yeah. Yeah, it's this way. Excuse me! I'm being harassed! Whee! Oh god! Uh... Ah! Okay, got another key. Now we can finally progress past that one path. I think. They tell you nothing. I they really don't. <laughs> they really don't. I mean, like, I'm not trying to say that I want like hand holiness or anything. But, like, at least some sort of prior experience that tells me, oh, this is the same thing I saw earlier, so I need to do this, or like a small hint of any kind would be great. <laughs> Otherwise, I'm just kind of like walking around for a little bit. What the heck is this? Oh boy. Another one of them puzzles. Maybe, do we just maybe like charge at it? Oh, there we go. Yeah! Easy peasy. All right. Olive Garden fills you up so much. Ugh, I think I'm going there later with my sister. I mentioned earlier at the beginning of the stream that I'm going to a family dinner later. I think that's where we're going. And I'm excited. Infinite breadsticks. Don't mind if I do. How nice, right? I love that place. All right. Apparently there's nothing in there. Uh, but there is something in here. This game looks so nice. Key! Alright, this is like the boss door, right? So we need a boss key. Nightmare key, to be specific. So, we'll go down that one staircase and uh, open up one, one, another one of those doors that we haven't gone through yet. Whoops! Oh my god, I almost fell off the stage. Alright, Coolio. 
Oh, man. Swamp 2.0. Were all these, like, hidden references to, like, Mario games and stuff? Those were in the original, right? I'm pretty sure they were. I'm pretty sure somebody told me that. All right, the Dongo Snakes was this way, I think? Yeah. We'll head back to the start. And then we'll open up another one of those locked doors that's at the bottom of that staircase. Which should be somewhere this way. Excuse me, bye. Oh, this dash is so nice, because okay, if anything steps in front of me, it's almost a one-hit kill. Uh, let's go to the left. This will be tricky. There's a little bit of a gap. Um, I think this one came from here. Oh my god. Oh my god. Get bamboozled. Whoops! Oh, I totally fudged that up. God, there we go. There we go. No! Don't fall off the conveyor belt! Ah! <laughs> I scrambled just to be able to grab that key. Yikes. Okay. So this, this pathway was completely useless, almost. It only served as a way for me to take a bunch of damage. So we're gonna go this way instead. Oh my god, there's another one. There's another one. So, bomb. Ooh, that one's gonna be tricky. Hey, okay, bomb. Ow! Aha! Oh, right on top of me, thank goodness. I don't have to scramble for that either. <laughs> Alright, just another room that I'd take a bunch of damage from. Uzumaki, welcome to the stream. How you doing? I love your icon, by the way. Breath of the Wild HD win. Or sorry, Skyward Sword HD win. Congrats, you have fell into ten, ten holes! Heck yeah, dude. I'm trying to break a record here, obviously. Oh my god. Can I stop getting hit with stuff? Woo! Man, we, we are just getting showered with keys now. Hallelujah. I think we found our, I think we found our stride, this one. Alright, we don't have a beak here either. I'm assuming the chest that we get from changing that switch. I'm going up this way. I'm assuming this chest has a key, like a, a beak in it? Yeah! Yeah! Oh yeah. It's all coming together. <laughs> okay. Oh, it was the upper, upper doorway. What's he gotta say? Far away, do not fear, dash and fly. Okay. Okay. God, it feels like we're finally making progress in this dungeon. Thank goodness for that. Bye. Bye! Okay. Alright, you guys. I think we're finally doing it. Uh, where was it from here? This way. Dash is so nice! Right. Poke suspicious parts of the wall with your sword and listen to the sounds it makes. Suspicious parts of the wall? Vicious parts of the wall. Vicious parts of the wall. You mean like... What the... Okay, that works! 
<laughs> Thanks for the tip, Uzumaki. Uh, he said poke suspicious parts of the wall with the sword. I'm not sure what that means, though. This, I think we can just dash across. Oh, wait, there's a there's a thingy. There's a little crack in the wall. I can't believe I just fell for my own bomb. Wow, I'm stupid. <laughs> there we go. Whoa! That clears you so far. Woo! Nightmare key! Oh, the boss fight is finally coming. Finally coming up. Hey, listen. He said poke suspicious parts of the wall. And I was just thinking that you had to dash into it or something. Uh, that's my defense and I'm sticking to it. So, where... Where is this boss door? In the basement. Ah, okay, I see. Um, you need to go back to start. Oh, man! Fight's not over yet! These dungeons are really long, Morks. <laughs> but that is the case with most Zelda games, isn't it? Most of your time is spent dungeon crawling, the rest of it is kind of like... You know, just talking to NPCs and getting their backstories and whatnot. Woo, thank goodness. Wait a minute, it's this way. Bye. 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 You're an NPC, Sansy. No, you. Wait. No, it's this way. I think it's to the left. I'm just gonna walk out with this thing. It dies. To the right! Ah, get off me! <laughs> Whatever, dude! Uh, okay, I'm lost. Um... How do you... We were just there not too long ago. Is there a staircase around here? Not this way. Not this way either, although... There are some hearts. There are some hearts that I need. Yes. Good lord. Good lord. This possessed jello is stealing all of my heart containers. Uh, Not this way either. Okay, never mind. My mistake. We went the wrong way. <laughs> Ugh. Once we find this boss door, it's all over. It's all over for this boss, whoever it ends up being. Oh no, there's a heart container! Yay! Yeah, that's right, I figured it out, Santi. Don't you think for a second I didn't! Right, maybe it's this way. Where was this... Nightmare. Nightmare door. E thing. Uh, uh, um. We need to go down to the basement. Uh. Isn't that a heart piece? The heart piece is the ones that you find on the map. Um, the heart containers are the ones like your health on the top left. That's technically. Technically, the, the terms for both. Epic B-Man Gamer Moment. Where is this boss fight? I'm lost! I found it earlier, and then I just kind of threw it in the back of my mind, not thinking about it anymore. Okay. So. It's like here, right? And then... <laughs> Where is this thing? <gasps> what? Whoop! Every Friday we have to read a book for 45 minutes and I forgot mine so I found a book on the floor that took... It took that and it was called The Book Thief. Ironic because I stole it for the 45 minutes. <laughs> that is... Like, the biggest brain thing. Ooh, what's this? I forgot to come in here.
cool. It's rupees, isn't it? A map! Wow, I could have beaten the dungeon without the map. Imagine that. Uh. Yeah, I know it's in the. I know it's where the red angry thing is. Like the angry looking thwomp. But which staircase was that? Is it this way? Good lo- Ah! Jesus! <sighs> Just look it up, dude. You know... Uh... One sec. Ah, okay. I think I know. I think I know where it is. Hold on. The one place that we haven't been in a while. This way. <laughs> it was right in front of us the whole time. There it is. We're gonna fight the boss. No, you. No, all of you. No, all of it. Whoops. Didn't mean to do that. Bye! See you later, nerds! I ain't got time for any keys. I'm opening the, this, this boss door. But we're heading in. Dear God, I'm scared. <laughs> neener, neener, you can't find me! Nya, nya. Oh, God. It's above us, isn't it? I see the shadow. We just keep killing these slimes until... Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh my! That's kind of horrifying. Uh, oh, we dashed through the middle. Right? No. Okay, we gotta be quick, I guess. Nah! Hard to angle these dashes. No? It's all jiggly. You guys seeing this? It's Bloomy Boys. Is this a yokai? <laughs> oh, there we go. Jeez. We have to do that again? I hope not. No! Oh, Christ. Oh, mama. Oh, okay, I see. I see the tech here. We have to jump before it actually hits the ground. Easy. Easy peasy. <laughs> this was PG! I did too! Nintendo's bamboozled us! This is a rated M game. This is a rated... What is it? NC-17? Wow. That was a little easier than I thought it was gonna be. Even though I'm one heart one heart container left. <gasps> hey, we got another one! Woo! Got a heart container. Your maximum number of hearts is decreased. How many do we have now? Eight? Or no, seven. Eight. Oh, eight. Never mind, I was right. Yay! And another another instrument. Is that a bell? Sea Lily's bell. Ooh. It's all, it's all coming together, guys. It's all coming together. So am I correct to assume that once we collect all the instruments, we're able to, like, play the piece that's going to wake up the windfish in a full, fully orchestrated fashion? Waterfall. Waterfall.
Something's hidden in the waterfall. Hmm. Okay, good to know. Sea Lily's Bell, pretty, yeah. A lot of these instruments that they're choosing to include are really pretty. How many instruments have you gotten so far? When you play the instruments in front of the egg, the windfish will... Oh, wow, there you go. The windfish will wake and you will leave this island. Now, you must hasten to the Yarna Desert! The dark, monstrous inhabitants of the sand will show you the way. Hoot hoot. Hoot hoot indeed. Okay, so Yarna Desert. Yarna Desert, is it like this way? Right? I'm assuming it's this, because this part of the map is, like, lit up. Connellet Castle. Okay, uh, we need to decide on a, on a flight path here. So, let's do this. Let's go back to, go back to the village, maybe, and, like, rest up, get all our items assorted and everything and then set foot from there, or set out from there. I'm calling you now that you're actually gonna have to fight the big bird, not sure. Yeah, me neither, but I'm kind of getting that same feeling too, Sansy. Oh, I almost ran into that cuckoo. What do I like to do? I like to play, I like to game. That's what I like to do. Alright, what's- have we gone in here yet? Ooh, I almost hit that kid. <laughs> Can I hit that kid? I don't know. <laughs> almost at two hours, I know. We're cutting it close. Dream sh what the- is this new? How have I not seen this? Is this new? Has this always been in the village? How have I not- I'm- I'm lost. <laughs> I don't know if this was supposed to happen, but we're, we're investigating. Oh my god, is this another dungeon? Literally just Earthbound. The dungeons are just the sanctuaries and you're both collecting music. Nest using the soundstone and then record the melody and you're just collecting instruments. Oh boy. If only I played Earthbound, I would be able to understand the reference you're making. But I'll trust you. I'll take you at your word. Dream Dungeon. This is kind of neat. <gasps> Whoa! Okay, wait. I'm going to go get that here in just a second. I want to get this chest first. <gasps> Whoa! We have an ocarina in here? It was hiding under us, our, right under our noses the whole time. Whoa! I'm excited. I'm excited. I want to go sing with uh, with Marin now. I want to I wanna play the music for her. I just finished my rusty level. Nice. Nice. Uh, feel free to submit it whenever you're ready, Happy Fox. Got the ocarina. You should learn to play many songs. Now that, that's tr that's right, Sansy. Now that, this is epic. This is epic gamer moments right here. He's like, wow, that was a great dream. Well, I'm gonna waddle my way back into town now. That is so wild. So do I have that in my inventory now? I do! I do! So, can I play with Marin? Well, it's an ocarina, but you don't know how to play- oh, Wow, okay, I have to learn songs. Marin, teach me a song! I knew it. A nice ocarina you have there, will you accompany me as I sing? This is gonna be so cute. Oh my god. Ah, look at it! You're right, Mika, that's true. I love this, me too! Really touching, isn't it? Doesn't it stick in your mind? Yes. Taking a, taking a screen recording of that. That was adorable. You've learned the ballad of the windfish. 
This song will always remain in your heart. Please remember this song. You should play it every once in a while to keep it fresh in your mind. Anything for you, Marin. We must protect her. She's too pure for this world. Um. Okay, well, now that... Now that we know that, uh, what are we... What is our goal here? Yar Yarna Desert. That's right. That's right. Um... Okay, uh, let's take a look at this map here. So... He said something about the sand inhabitants? The sand inhabitants? What do you guys think? Does the bird thing give you the warp? I don't think so. The song will always remain in your heart? Oh yes. Yes it will. <laughs> um... Well, I think, uh, I think maybe, like, if we go up this way, no. I'm trying to investigate the map and see where we're supposed to go. Um... I don't know, but when I hear the word desert, like, all the sand stuff is up here. Hold on. Go to... there's like a memory section, right? Yeah. Alright, let's see what he says. The dark, monstrous inhabitants of the sand. Oh, is that like the cemetery? It says dark, monstrous inhabitants. Is that like the ghosts and stuff? At the cemetery? This way? Well, guess there's only one way to find out. We have a little bit of time to go and explore and see where we- where our next destination is gonna be. Let's do that. Oh my god, I don't wanna- I don't wanna hit the cuckoos! I'm trying to dash so I can go faster, but I don't wanna hit them. It's my first time playing the game! The story in its entirety, Morks. But true, you're right. You're right, and I'm loving it though. Like, I'm really, really enjoying this game. A lot more than I thought I would. Um, being my first 2D Zelda game and all, I was kind of apprehensive, like, eh. I don't know, what if I don't like the format or like, the 2D thing? Like, I know it's gonna be a little bit different than traditional 3D Zelda games, so I don't know if I'm actually gonna like it at all. But I'm actually really enjoying this. Despite the fact that some parts of the game feel a little, uh... Like... Not as obvious as... <laughs> as others. What the? I'm still enjoying it nonetheless. Oh, we can... Whoa! Now we can warp! Now we have two of these. Okay, that's kind of cool. I like that. I want this game, but I am broke. Hey, if you end up winning the Rusty competition, that'll be a bit more progress towards your eventual goal of a uh, full-blown, full-price Switch game. You know? Okay. What is this? The windfish sleeps long and dreamily in the egg above. When you play the eight instruments of the sirens in front of the egg, he will awaken. This, my friend, is the only way for you to finally leave the island. Okay, so the windfish is like literally up here. Mount Tamaranch. Dang, look at that. He's just sleeping up there. Man, that must be awesome, sleeping. Huh, <laughs> wonder what that's like. I can only imagine 
what sleep feels like. <sighs> okay. Okay. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Uh... Good God! That did not work out. Uh... <laughs> Really? He knocked me into the staircase, now it's gonna reset the entire puzzle? Wow. How many, how many heart pieces do we have? Two. We need two more. I'm just kind of exploring at this point. I'm not even sure if this is actually the way we're supposed to be going. We're supposed to be exploring the cemetery, I'm pretty sure, but... If this is gonna give me, like, heart pieces and stuff, then I'm all for it. What the heck? How am I supposed to get across there? Oh, wait, it's this way. It's this way. Come on! Oh, it's so close. It's so close. You guys are have to gonna... You guys are definitely gonna have to update your hole counter a little quickly here. Oh my god, that was an accident. <laughs> what the heck? How are you supposed to get there? Like, he lands on the ground and then it... You know what? Alright. Alright. I think that's... I, th I think it's too far for us to actually reach. Hulltown Mountain Range. Cool. Some rupees. Always down for some more of those. I have almost a thousand. I'm at 784. I need to find something to spend them on. Maybe I should have stayed in the village and like chopped around a little bit. Hey, it's that guy! Pa Paul! Pa Paul. I think that's how you pronounce it. Oh wait, no, the 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 um there was like a hint that said there's something behind the waterfall. No, nothing. Okay. What about here? I don't know. I'm just kind of experimenting right now. Nothing. Okay. A little crawl space here. That's a little much true. Upwards we go. Bye. Wow, I got tricked! All right, Papal, 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 Papal. What are you doing up here, Mister? Papal got lost, just like he said. Now I am so famished I can't move. Can you give me some vittles? 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 I have no idea what those are. I'm, so, I'm assuming we'll find them, though. Okay, let's, uh, let's just actually head to the cemetery now. Oh my god, I almost fell! Watch out for the hole. I will. Don't worry. I'm trying to keep that hole counter as low as possible. It's this way. Wait, is it this way? What's over here? I'm. Ugh. Why am I so curious?
Where am I going on the map? Okay. You know what? I'm gonna fight my own curiosity here and head to the cemetery because I'm pretty sure that's where we're supposed to be going. Even if I do make it through this part, it's probably gonna be a point in time where I actually hit something where I can't progress because I'll need a certain item or something. So we're just gonna go this way. To the wasteland. Uh... Now maybe, at the, like, at, at... Oh, wait, there's like a tombstone here, right? That looks different than the rest of them? I'm scared, I'm lost. I'm lost and scared. Ah, I don't know! I don't know! But it said, it said like the, the monstrous inhabitants, which I assume meant like spooky, spooky monsters, which is definitely like a cemetery vibe, right? Oh, phone dude, true. All right, let's consult Urira. I don't like saying his name. Urira? Urira? It's got like weird, weird phonetics around with it. I don't know. It just sounds odd. But like, those are monsters. That thing that was just chasing me, that was a monster. Ow. Uh, where is the nearest phone thingy? Oh, here we go. Okay. Let's see. What's he got to say? In the Yarna Desert, which is located to the southeast of the island, you will find something called the Angler Key. How much more obvious do I have to be? Wow! Wow! Okay, so southeast. Southeast. Which is like this way. Do we need to go through... How do we get there? Do we need to go through this part of the map? I think so. I think so! Thank you, Ulrira. True, I know, right? Every game needs an Ulrira. Just in case there are players that get lost along the way, you know, you don't want them getting too frustrated and, like, not playing the game anymore, right? So, every game needs a dual rerun. Don't worry, Mika. Don't worry, Mika. It's okay. I will make it speedy. Speedy and fast. Look at us go. Breath of the Wild needs an Ulrira, true. Although that would probably kind of ruin the... Or not necessarily ruin, but like go against the spirit of the game, right? Which is like, you know, freedom of exploration and finding things out. Um, just from like looking around, you know? I don't know. Ooh, there's a key! I'm just gonna play the... I'm gonna play this at every single point of significance on the map, just in case. But there's the secret behind the waterfall, which I think we just found. So, we're in the right spot, it looks like. And thank goodness there's more than one warp point around the map, too. That'll save some extra time later on. Uh... What is down here? Um... Hmm... So... This might be like a side dungeon then. Uh... Hmm... Nothing you can get to yet, I don't think so. Yeah, I don't think so either. I was like, this can't be the way. And I was thinking to myself, like, what the... What the heck am I supposed to do here? Uh... Where 
am I even? I don't think we need to go this way either. Like this part of the map? Because in order to go south, we need to be able to swim. Unless I can make it across this gap, but if I can't, then we're gonna have to try a new angle. Yep. One more time, maybe I just pressed the button up or something. Okay, yeah, the game purposely inhibits how far you can actually travel there. My jump is stunted for whatever reason. So... Okay, I'm actually gonna warp instead of walking. I have a buttload of time. Let's go to the prairie. And uh, go, go eastbound from there. Just kind of come at this uh, this part of the map from all angles, you know? Isn't there like an animal village around somewhere? I remember seeing a sign that was like Martha's, Martha's Beach or something and then like the animal village. Maybe it's through there? I just looked at the eShop and Snake Pass and it looks like fun! Even if I don't win, which is extremely likely, I'll still probably end up getting the game. It's it's interesting, to say the least. I have it on uh, uh, I have it on Switch as well, and uh, the controls are very awkward and weird and kind of reminiscent of Octodad. If you've ever uh, seen or played that game before, in that uh, the controls are very modeled around how snakes actually move in real life. So you have to move pretty much each part of the snake in conjunction with where you want to go. And it, and it creates for some really funny scenarios where you're like wrapping yourself in really weird fashions around certain objects and it, it's just really goofy. And uh, I think people would really like it if they ended up giving it a chance. That's good, that's awesome that you checked that out. So this way, right? Let me read this sign real quick. Yeah, Animal Village is this way. Excuse you! Can I, like... No. Oh, God. Move it! Oh, wow, I actually can't swim that way. Uh... Or, like, jump that way, I mean. There's water this way. I'm surrounded by water! Do I need, like... Because if, if the frog guy didn't give me what I'm looking for, then I'm, I guess I'm looking for something else in the meantime. What else in the Zelda series has given you the ability to swim? Blue tunics? Is that what I'm looking for? I think that's what I'm looking for. Like a blue tunic? Because if it was like a frog suit or something, that guy would have definitely given it to me already, Richard. Alec has discovered that Link is on an island. <laughs> I'm surrounded by water! Can you believe that? Hmm. Where would you even get a blue tunic from? I don't even know, man. <sighs> okay, well, something has to happen over here this way, because there's no there's really nothing else of concern, I don't think, in the, uh, in the rest of the map, so we- GOD! Should be going this way. What if it's not a tunic? If it's like a frog suit or something, that'd be really funny. I don't know, but like, clearly we need an item of some sort to be able to swim. Excuse me. Golly, like, I don't... I don't know what we're doing here. Uh... Hmm. So... Is it like... Uh... Hmm. 
I don't know. I feel like it's this part of the map. Where we just were. Like over here, because th there's a sign. Which leads me to believe that it was placed there, so it can remind you that, hey, Animal Village is like nearby. What was this again? I don't know. I'm just kind of grasping at straws here. Oh, wait! No! This has like the tent thingies in here, and then we can- Oh my god, how did I forget about that? Wow. Jeez. Jeez. The gall. Martha's Bay. Okay. The Animal Village. Animal Village is... Wow. It was that easy the whole time. So I, I have this... I, I think I have this problem of maybe just overthinking the puzzles that this game gives me. Am I overthinking it or are they just not providing enough information? I don't know. I don't know. The way to get there to the south, but you might not be able to get through it if that lazy walrus is in the way. Hmm. Lazy walrus. Gathering clues. Um. Yeah, it'll probably be like a more of a you one kind of thing, Happy Fox. I'll definitely collect everybody's levels that submitted it, that submitted, and uh, put them on a list if everyone wants to play through them. I am Shul Donovich! The mermaid statue by the bay is my masterpiece. To tell you the truth, that work is not complete. The art is difficult for you to grasp, is it not? <laughs> That's how I read his voice in my head. Wow, Hippo Model says go away, so we're going away. Here's seven minutes overtime. Ah! We find the next big objective if we can. If we can. And then uh, we'll be on our way. You don't know the proper etiquette when dealing with a lady, do you? You should have brought flowers or something. Then I might be more inclined to talk with you. Oh yes, in my case, hibiscus are the best. <gasps> Wait a minute! Wait a minute! I have this. I have a honeycomb. Is this another like trading thing where I have to trade up to a hibiscus flower? To give this lady to be able to to be able to make more progress? I think so. I think that's what we're dealing with here. Alright, let me let me I'm just gonna explore all the uh, all the village here for a second. And then we'll do the thing. Look at this bear? Hey you, is it possible that you is that possibly a honeycomb you have? I just ran out! Will you swap it for a pineapple? Sure. Sure. It's not as sweet, but it is delicious. Ah. Hi-ho! Yeah, I know. That tub of goo is asleep right in the way to Yarna Desert. Wow, that was toxic! <laughs> when he's asleep, he won't budge for a long time. But hey, take a little Marin and wake her up with her singing. That slob would wake up with a jump if he heard her sing, for sure. Take Marin and have her sing? You mean, like, play the ocarina next time? Maybe. That might be what we'll need. Can't go to Mommy Village because of all the monsters. I hope Marin is alright. Well, that's kind of cool everyone knows Marin here. Alright, where is this walrus that everyone speaks of? There he is. Nothing. Is this- this isn't gonna work, is it? I gotta go. Thanks for the fun time. Have a good one, Happy Fox. Thanks for hanging out with us, dude. I appreciate you. Enjoy the rest of your night. Really nothing back here, is there? Well, maybe! Art container. Art container. Marin is friends with animals. Disney princess confirmed. Practically! She sings, she talks to the animals, she has a, like a princely royal love interest. I don't know. You get the idea. I think you actually need Marin. Well, what the heck am I supposed? Am I supposed to just go like, ask her nicely? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, okay, so what's the item that I have now? A pineapple? What does one do? The pineapple. Okay. 
How close are we? are like literally one spot away from this part of the map. Jeez. Ugh. Man. Okay, well, um... I guess we gotta go find Marin. Yeah, we were supposed to leave like 10 minutes ago, but I feel like we're right on the cusp of getting the next... the next part of this story. We'll make an exception. Um... Uh, where did we come from? Oh yeah, underneath. Underneath, in this staircase. Oh my god. <laughs> Marion, I need you! He's gonna be without you. There's- I have a, like a good 15 minutes left before everyone leaves. So I think I have just a little bit of time. Apples! That song's kind of catchy. The Ballad of the Windfish. All right, we're sprinting. We're literally running to our objective. Woo, that was close. Thank goodness for this dash. It makes me travel so much further. Will you ever stream other Fire Emblem routes? Probably not. Just because it's taking so long for us to get through our current one. Where's Marin? The one time I need her, she's like run off somewhere. I need to maybe like play the song next to the statue or something. Oh my god, man. Um. Well, um. Talk to the kid. No, true, true. They, these kids know everything. What's happened to her? Oh my god, he actually- never mind, he doesn't know anything. Well, there's kids over here, I think. Giant egg at wow! Useless! Useless! Grandma? Whoops! Can Grandma tell us anything? Whoops, my bad. Worked too hard and now my broom is worn to the handle. Uh, uh, <laughs> I don't know. Um. Crap. Phone guy, true. Oh, that's a good point. Ulrira, tell us what to do. Please. It's Vortex, welcome to the stream. Yeah, he's not telling us anything. Got nothing. Hmm. Crap, I keep eating the chickens. Yeah, no help at all. Um. Gosh, like, I don't... I don't know. I don't, I don't think she has a house. Does she? Playing Castle Crushers Remastered for Switch and somehow completed it. Nice. Which uh, which knight did you end up using? Which color? I think she has a house here. It's not here, right? Oh, I guess it's here. Heck, at the beach. At the beach. That's all we needed to know. All right, we're gonna race to the beach, pick up Marin, and that'll probably be where we can uh, we can come to a uh, to a halt for a little bit. The purple dude, the purple one's good. That's like the necromancer one, right? For my first playthrough, I'm gonna use the blue one just like I did when the game originally came out. I originally played it on the Xbox 360 back in the day. And I'm gonna do my Blue Knight run through the same way I did it in that one. Is it 
beach is all the way down here. Ah, leave me be! <laughs> yes, yeah, same. Did you play it on the 362? That is super cool. I like how they also incorporated like Alien Hominid and some of the other secret unlocks uh, in the remastered version as well, even though the original unlock methods for them aren't exactly available anymore. I think that is super cool. Marin! I'm glad you found this place. Will you stay and talk to me for a while? Of course. Even though everything else is, you know, people need our help and whatnot. We'll do anything for you, Marin. Oh, look at this. This is like a cutscene or something. Love it. Screenshot. Love it. I wonder what they're talking about. I wonder where these coconut trees come from. Karen says there's nothing beyond the sea. But I believe there must be something over there. Aww. That's so cute. When I discovered you, Link, my heart skipped a beat. I thought, this person has come to give us a message. Link has said no words this entire time. <laughs> what sort of message is he conveying? If I was a seagull, I would fly as far as I could. I would fly to faraway places and sing for many people. If I wish to the windfish, I wonder if my dream will come true. She's adorable. Like, so cute. Are you listening? Link, are you listening to me? Uh, uh, yeah. Yeah, definitely. Uh, I was, I was listening. <laughs> I want to know everything about you. The walrus wants me to go to him? Well, all right, let's go. All right, well, I guess that. <laughs> it's like it's like I just picked up an item or something. You got Marin. <laughs> what the heck? Well, all right, let's uh, let's travel that way real quick, I guess. Can she keep up? Oh my God, she's dashing! Look at that dash animation she has. Oh, so cute. Excuse me. <laughs> I almost wish the art style could better convey how the, nice the scene is. I think it looks as nice as it needs to be. Whoops. Oh, was there a shortcut? Crap. Okay, well, let's go do that. It'll probably be faster than... Going through all those enemy-infested forests this way. Thanks for looking out on that one. <laughs> Was that a shortcut to Animal Village, though? I guess we'll find out. <laughs> ah! I'm so glad I can lift stuff up now. So convenient. You were so right! What's in this house? What's in this house? I must investigate. What the... Oh, never mind, she's judging me. I'll come back later. <laughs> I'll come back later. Ooh, wait a minute. She cleared that jump, no problem! Uh, This way. Marin, look out, these guys are bad news! Oh, she doesn't care. Uh... Do I go through here, maybe? Bye! Marin, run! Okay, where are we on the map? Uh, we need to go this way. There we go. There's the staircase. I was kind of concerned that I was gonna have to like protect Marin or something on the way here. I'm kind of glad we don't. See ya, see ya, piranha-infested waters. 
All right, to Animal Village. We're almost there, guys. Look at us cutting grass like it's nothing. All right. Let's go wake up this walrus. Oh, wait, there's a teleporty thing here? This will come in handy later. I might as well activate it now. Uh, how did we? Right. Wait. <laughs> I was like, where's the walrus again? There we go. Easy. Right here. Marin, sing for him. Yes, it's that lazy walrus. Shall we give him a little surprise? Yes. He's so cute. This whole game is so cute. Why am I? Why do I even bother saying that anymore? He's dancing. He's dancing. And wow, he just kind of like backflipped into the ocean. <laughs> he certainly woke with the start. Bunny. He's calling me. It's the same as always. Link, I'm going to the animal village. Please drop by, okay? Oh, wait, the hibiscus is going to come from Marin, isn't it? <laughs> he did. <laughs> and that's how he died. So these, I don't think you actually hold these items. You just eat them off the ground. Please don't ever forget this song for me. That is adorable. Look at this scene. How cute! Oh my god, man. Alright, well, I think we've accomplished our goal. We've opened up the pathway to Yarna Desert, it looks like, from this little section of the map. So I think, just like last time, we're gonna go ahead and end on a scene where Marin is singing to us adorably and peacefully. And with animals surrounded by her because she's a real Disney princess. Anyways, we're gonna go ahead and take off for the night. So. I'm just going to leave this scene open while we while we say our goodbyes. Have a good rest of your night, everyone. Thank you all so much for tuning in. Um, I'm going to go get some dinner with my family. And since I'm about 20 minutes later than I wanted to leave, I'm going to make this as short as possible. So uh, this coming week on the 30th, and that's in a few days, is when our Rusty competition ends. So if you have a Mario Maker 2 level to submit for the Rusty competition, which there is a prize for, by the way, uh, feel free to make those submissions before the deadline on the 30th, and then we'll make our judgments on the 4th, and then I'll announce the winner a few days after that. So, look out for that. In the next couple days, also look out for a video uh, covering Mario Kart Tour. Played it for the first time yesterday. Did a whole entire session where I recorded all my thoughts on it, so look out for that in the next few days as well. And uh, this coming week, we'll probably continue more of our Link's Awakening playthrough, since I'm really enjoying this. Um, and then obviously we'll do... Uh, October 4th, which is a week from now, we'll, we'll do that stream where we play through everyone's uh, rusty levels and then uh, all that stuff. So anyway, um, lots of fun stuff to look forward to. And this coming month as well, the big release is going to be uh, obviously Luigi's Mansion on the 31st on Halloween. So you best believe, you best believe I have some exciting things planned for that day as well. So anyway, I'm going to go get some food now. You guys have a good rest of your evening and... Um, um, I guess there's only one thing left to say before we take off, and that is, of course, as always, I'm Alec and Stuff, and I will see you all again real soon. Bye! Have a good rest of your evening, everyone. Thank you all so much for tuning in. I'm really, I just, I love the fact that you guys are enjoying my, uh, th this playthrough of the game as much as I am, because I am so taken aback by how much I really am... Like, this is my first Zelda game, so I'm just really enjoying the fact that I'm enjoying it, too. And I'm glad that you guys are also along for the ride and um, appreciating this game for what it is. So, anyway, I'm, I'm uh, going to go now. Um, I'm going to put on a very special, very special, very short song to play us out on, okay? So, you have a good rest of your night, everyone. I'm going to mute the mic now. If you need me, I'll be in Discord for the rest of the evening. Bye, guys! See ya! <gasps> Bye.